Shalom, TikTok. How the hell are you? Well, today I'd like to talk about fallen angels, or should I say fallen stars? But first, let's read a Bible verse. It says here in Genesis 6, 2, that the sons of Yahuwah saw the virgins of men that they were sexy, and they defiled all of which they chose. You see, in the biblical days, they had many wives. They didn't go down to courthouse and get a marriage license. They just defiled them. When you have sex with someone, that constitutes marriage, you see, in the Bible. You know, all throughout history, when the elite get exposed, their dirty little secrets come to life, what they'll do is bring the house of cards down. That way they can go into their bunkers, destroy the earth, and then rebuild it. You got to get rid of all the people once you get exposed, you see. But I guess y'all been hearing about old Puff Diddy. Well, he's about to bring the house of cards down. You see, in this type of business, blackmail is your biggest friend or your security blanket. What you want to do in this line of business is have blackmail on everybody, especially high people in high places, powerful people. Like old Branson right here, and I put up at the top, who's your diddy? Now down here in Matthew 23, 9, it says, And call no man your diddy on the earth, for none is your diddy, which is... Uh, for one is your deity which is in heaven. So I wonder why everybody calls him deity. You see, it's a big old mafia club, and you peons just aren't invited. And I know you Christians aren't going to like me for exposing y'all's hero or your savior. Such a good guy. Such a good Christian right there. You know, I mean, he didn't have affiliates with Epstein and all them guys, you know. But anyway, uh, let's move on. There's old Meanie right there. There's old Meanie Trump right there, ain't it? I bet her little V-hole is so sore she can't hardly walk most days. You, you know what I'm saying? I mean... She looks like they just got done using her right there, don't it? You don't reckon Trump would share his, his wife, do you? Or his daughter? No, the elite don't do that. They don't trade off their youngins, do they? You know, if I was one of these evil elite, what I'd do is I'd start businesses and call it virgin. See, they love them some virgins. They sure do. Look at all them businesses right there that... From the virgin, you don't reckon he's trying to tell you guys something, do you? And pay special attention to these stars right here. See, these are fallen stars. And he's only worth about $2.7 billion. Boy, wouldn't it be nice to have some blackmail on him, man? That would be cool right there. You know, I bet most of these Christians would like to have them a star on the Hollywood Walk of Shame, don't you? I wonder where that star comes from. You know, I've wondered about that a lot. Where does the American star come from? Strange, isn't it? Maybe you guys can give me some comments and help me figure out where that star might symbolize it. You know, a, a big elite group of people that Maybe you're not invited to hang out with. You know what I'm saying? Can you imagine, only imagine what it would be worth if you had some blackmail on the royal family itself? Wouldn't that be cool? Or what if the royal family had blackmail on everybody else? See, a lot of these guys are peons, like old Epstein and Diddy right here. What we need to do is find out where the root of the problem might come from. You know, who was in control of all of these 
uh, sex trafficking. I wonder where it comes from. There's got to be somebody that's in charge or was in charge of this whole operation. You know, maybe you guys can help me figure out who that might be. You know, I, I posted this old image down here at the bottom years ago right here. But I want you to notice the server. Let me get over here. You see this outfit? that Trump's wearing right there. See, that's a servant. You see it? You know, like if you was in a big high-class restaurant and the server come up to you, this is what he would be wearing right here, is this, this type of outfit right here. So he's really showing you that he's a servant of the Queen Lizard. But do you have eyes to see? Do you have eyes to see her son up here? He's a good guy. You guys idolize these people. And especially this one, Christian. Let me see if I can get my finger here to work. Good. Are you guys enjoying the show so far? Are you got man, you... <laughs> it's time to wake up. I think it's about too late to wake up. You know, tomorrow's the 23rd, and I made uh, a video on September the 23rd. You guys should go check it out. A lot of things are happening on the 23rd. Tomorrow, on moon day, on moon day, supposed to get that second moon. I sure hope that ain't wormwood. What if that thing just kept getting bigger and bigger and bigger in the sky. Would it scare y'all? Well, the Bible says men's hearts will fail them for fear of what's coming to the earth. What if we could look up there and see old Wormwood coming for about a month or two? Just get getting bigger, closer, closer, and closer. But you guys get excited because Babylon is about to fall. You can fall with it or you can find Yahuwah and the door to Yahuwah is Yahusha Hamashiach. He's the door. Yahusha Hamashiach is the Dalet, the doorway. He is symbolic of to obedience to the Father. You see, he obeyed the Father. He didn't teach a bunch of Christians that you could hang the law on, on a pagan cross and not obey him anymore. So for all you swine eaters, y'all get excited because your desolation draws nigh. I hope you guys that's in the truth, that can see the truth, will do your part and share truth videos, expose evil, bring it to light. It even says in scripture that nothing hidden won't be revealed. It'll all be revealed here in the end times. Just all, like all these crooks that's been running your world. Ma Fia. Y'all know who Ma is, don't you? Well, I've made other videos to show you who Ma is. But these are all servants of Ma. They call themselves the sons of light, but I like to refer to them as the sons of darkness. But you guys share, give me your thoughts, and uh, check out my other videos. Because mo for most of you, again, your desolation draws nigh. Shalom.